Hello world! In this video I will demonstrate a new app and it's called DroneLink. It is not free available, however there is a beta version and if you apply for the beta version you get the link and you can test it. It is still in development but it is extremely promising. It's an app where I'm really looking forward to fly with. It's, um, it is an addition to most of the apps I already have and of course the big competitor here is Autopilot. But because Autopilot services stopped about a year ago, there is no more updates, there is no more communication. I don't think it's even compatible with the Mavic Pro 2. So there needs to be something else. And I think DroneLink will be that something else. It's, um, it's completely programmable. Um, there is a very nice web interface where you can program everything you need. There is a test flight in the web app so you can see where your drone is pointing what is he doing it's very comprehensive you basically the big difference between this and of course uh, autopilot is that because of the interface you have to make uh, with your right mouse click um, conditions and those conditions represent something you're going to do start filming increase elevation stop filming turn left turn right whatever you want um, that works already very good. The basic modes available now is of course A to B, waypoint missions, orbit, but all other modes are coming. And um, so we're, um, I'm really looking forward to, uh, to play with this, um, with this new app and it might very well be my next favorite app to fly with. Um, the mission I'm doing now is uh, what we call a complex mission, which means that you're flying a mission and the drone is pointing at a different direction than where you're flying at. In this case I work with uh, points of interest and markers to indicate where you do. That basically works the same in uh, like in autopilot. It's just a little bit different programming. That's, uh, it's, it's just a different program, so that's something you have to use it. To get used to. However, the web interface works very good, especially if you do your test flight, you can see very clearly what's going on, you have a clear path, it looks really really good. So without further ado, I will uh, work on the video, you will see it, you will see what's gonna happen. I have first the programming, then the flying and then the result in that order and um, I'm really looking forward to your reactions. From the video of course uh, subscriptions also but very important because as i said i'm in close contact with the developers your questions and everything with regards to drone link so i can forward it to the people involved and if there's any questions which i can't answer i'm not a specialist yet we'll try to help you as good as we can so let's start flying i'll see you later
that was my first impression with DroneLink. A really, really remarkable app. If you are a serious drone flyer, I um, think this is, uh, this is the app you should need. It's still in beta, so there are still some uh, things to be worked on. But the potential is there and it's, uh, it's, it's doing a remarkable thing, even although it's still in beta. You can be a test pilot if you want. You go to the website of Apple um, in the iStore, in the iTunes store, and you download test flight. You ask for the application as uh, on the website from drone link and you can install the app and you can basically fly. It's still free, it will, won't be free forever. But for now, as a test flight, you still can use it and you can see all the remarkable possibilities of the, of the drone. It's fully functioning, the web page is there, so you can use it, you can try it and you can convince yourself you get a really good, uh, a really good, good app. Of course, I will put all the links below where you can uh, download everything and get the more information, the website, the Facebook page and everything you want. If there's any questions, you can ask them there or you can send directly an email to erik at webovfx.com and everybody will help you as much as you can. So that was my short video this time. Please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and give me a subscription if possible. And we can wait for the next video. Okay, all the best and I'll see you later. Bye. Thank you.